Hello, this is Nick with Nick'sComputerFix.com and here's a video on um, how to speed up Windows 10 and it's free and easy. What I do is give you a good number of steps to take to make it faster. Alright, let's get started by going down to the start menu here and uh, we want to right click and then click on run and then type percent temp percent on the run command line there and then click on OK. That opens up this um, file manager for you and then we'll enlarge that and we want to go ahead and select all of these um, and delete them and once you have them all selected right click and then go ahead and click on delete now keep in mind you select them all by holding down the shift key and uh, if you don't know how to do that um, I can uh, leave that in the description on exactly the procedure on how to go about that now as you can see here some of these require um, admin permission so go ahead and click continue and you can also go ahead and say do the same thing for all of them if you like now in some cases and in this one this one um, was not um, deletable and that's okay because it was in use all right um, the next step here is go back down to the start menu again and right click and that opens up the hidden menu go up click on run opens up the run command line and this time we just want to go ahead and type the word temp and once you do um, we'll get this go ahead and give it permission and on the right hand side we want to delete all these files and folders because they're all temporary so we're going to go ahead and select all of them um, via the shift key again and then right click and click on delete alright once you've got those all um, delete it we can go ahead and close this out and the next step that I suggest is to disable some of the startup programs um, that you don't need running and we can go ahead and do that by going down to our um, taskbar here right clicking go up and click on task manager and once you have task manager open up here under startup click there and these are the programs that are starting up that uh, are eating up resources that you may not need to have run and uh, the way you go about doing it is right clicking and disabling them now I have a few here you may have a couple of dozen so keep that in mind and what is really important is not to disable um, a couple of programs that you do want running and for instance you, in this case Windows Defender that's my security program that's my antivirus protection program I do not want to disable that and I suggest you don't disable that as well okay once that's completed we'll go ahead and close that out and we're going to go ahead and go to our next step here by opening up uh, Windows 10 file manager and I happen to have mine uh, pinned to my taskbar here. Once open, locate your local disk C, which is normally your system disk. Right click and opens up the menu. Click on properties. And let me go ahead and move this into the center so that we can see it better. Um, and right here, disk cleanup, we want to go ahead and click on that. And this can take a couple of seconds to a few minutes and then this window opens up now I like to um, take the defaults that are checked and uh, go ahead and click on OK on this but if you feel comfortable with um, um, also cleaning up your system files that's up to you um, I like to just take the defaults and leave my system files alone and click on OK and then it asks you for permission go ahead and say delete files and this again can take a couple of seconds to a few minutes now what this is doing is freeing up um, additional storage space on your hard drive and uh, it will help uh, run the computer a little bit smoother because you have more disk space alright let's go ahead and close this out and move on to our next step which is system defrag so we can open up our defrag that's uh, built in to Windows 10 by going down to our search bar here and go ahead and type in defrag and it gives you a list of uh, options here this is the one that's built in this is one that I've downloaded for free I like them both 
Um, so let's just use the free one that's built into Windows 10. I clicked on that and this will optimize your drive. So highlight if it's not um, your system drive, which is C. And keep in mind that this will automatically, um, you know, go ahead and run um, in this case weekly for me. But um, if you want to do it, you know, manually um, earlier, um, this is the way that you would go about it. And you can optimize or just go ahead and run it. So I'm just going to go ahead and run it. And uh, as you can see, it's moving along and it's defragging um, my uh, C drive, which is my system drive. And this will take a, a while. So um, I'm not going to sit here and waste your time and let you watch this forever. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and close this out and move on to our next step which is to reduce the amount of boot up time um, to get into Windows 10. Go down to your start menu, right click, click on run. Once you have the run command open, type in msconfig and then click on OK. That opens up the system configuration file or window. And then go ahead um, up top here, click on boot. And then down on the right hand side here, the timeout change that from the default 30 seconds to 7 seconds and then click on apply and click on OK. Now that will decrease the amount of time it takes to um, have your computer boot up into Windows 10. And um, right here you can, uh, if you don't want to optimize any more um, items within Windows 10, you can go ahead and click on um, restart. Um, or exit without restart and I'm just going to click on the X and uh, go ahead and go and move on to our next step that I'm going to show you which is to open up uh, Windows 10 settings so let's go down to our start menu here left click and click on the settings icon and once the Windows settings is open, go ahead and click on the category apps. And once apps and features is open, this is where it's really handy um, to uninstall any apps or, you know, um, program or software um, applications that you have installed that you no longer need you know why have them installed and running or you know using up your hard drive space and your memory and your system resources so um, go through the list that you might have and if you see something that you don't want to have installed any longer go ahead and remove it you can always install it again later Okay, let's go down to our start menu again, left click, go up and click on settings. And once again, that opens up our Windows settings window. And the category that we want to go ahead and click on is gaming. And once you have the gaming um, settings window open, um, you can see here that you can adjust a lot of things that uh, will enhance your gaming experience. In some versions, you actually have a button here that allows you to turn game mode on and off. And uh, you may have it, you may not have it, depending on which version of Windows 10 that you're running. Um, once again, go through all these settings and adjust them to accordingly to um, what you like. Okay, um, we've come to the end of this video. I'm sure that you will discover that once you apply all of these changes to your computer, that your overall computer's performance will improve. Okay, that's the end of this video. So subscribe if you like and leave a like if you like. Have a great day.